Hello and welcome folks, this is Krishna and welcome back to my channel. From the thumbnail, you probably know where I am headed. I leave a card in this area here to show you when I came there for the first time. That's exactly two years ago, sometime around now, July. And I'm going back there again. Stay tuned, keep watching. I'll show you some interesting stuff. This was not really an impromptu uh, travel thing. It's at the same time very impromptu because they were predicting bad weather and as usual they have been lying. You know, the mid department, they lie these days. Uh, phone apps, they lie. Everybody lies. So uh, they said that it will rain all day and finally we figured out that it's not raining. So yeah, stay tuned. And she's driving really fast now. Speed limit is like around 100. We're doing 140 to again, <laughs> racing to get very tiga. The way she drives around the corners, she understands her car so well, handling everything. I sincerely believe she had a career in racing, starting from go-karting, going all the way up till F1. Folks, we have arrived and I will show you, but unfortunately it looks like inside seating is still not available. Folks, as you can see, I'm at Turnstile Coffee Roasters in New Jersey, right next to the Belmar Beach. Uh, I was here, as I said, exactly two years ago. That's when I discovered this coffee roaster. It's one of my favorite coffee roasters. Not really close to town. We had to drive uh, more than an hour to get here. And unfortunately, it's not open inside, but I just ordered my coffees and we'll be sitting outside and I'll give you a feedback on the coffee. The inside, as I said, they haven't yet opened up, but there's this little garden patio kind of place. Very nicely done where we are sitting. I just ordered a Congo. She's having the Ethiopia Sidama bomb with some half and half added to it. Let's try the coffees. Whatever Krish is doing for me, it tastes 100 times better than what I buy. So he is really an excellent uh, master. I let the coffee sit for a while, aired it, and it is really rich, caramelized sweetness. It's it's a really good cup of coffee. Great pour over. Don't style will never disappoint you. I just met Mike Ayers, and unfortunately I didn't have my camera, but I got the Sidamo, and I'll show you. Big surprise. Can you just pass me the bag of Sidamo, please? Oh, sure. I got a Sidamo from uh, George's Coffee Roasters and I just bought this bag of Sidamo and you won't believe. Katrina, can you can you can you say what is special about the Sidamo? Light mad roast natural process or natural process. Yes. Oh you found it? Yes, it's unbelievable. Oh. I, I found a natural process and I asked Mike Ayers oh. how come? Because they used to carry the Sidam bomb uh, Bombay or whatever they call it. That was washed and but now Mike just answered me and they said that they are trying to keep at least one variety of a natural process coffee, which is amazing. I will making I'll be making this very shortly and I'll be sharing with you guys on this channel. So do keep following and I'll definitely make this coffee pretty soon for you guys. You come all the way to Belmar and you don't come to the beach is actually it's actually sacrilegious. So shout out to Rajdeep Pine. Rajdeep, to be Diga Gacho. I'm your Belmar Beach Chole Inspired by your Diga vlog. Shout out to you man. Actually I was just corrected. This is not Belmar Beach. Belmar is where we had coffee which invigorated us and now we are at where did it say? Monta looking Monta looking beach. About 20 kilometers north of, south of, sorry, south of Belmar. the warmest that I've seen but then this is the Atlantic you don't expect the water to be warm anywhere not even probably in the Caribbean islands <laughs> I've got used to the cold now and 
I love, I love the ocean. Awesome place to be. Not very deep here. And you can see now behind me how far the beach is from me. And I'm still walking. The water is about at the level of five feet. Come on. weather is jhunne. The beach is empty because of bad weather. The beach is there aren't too many people. There's nobody on the beach. Just me and and she's sitting back there. And I'm I'm thoroughly enjoying the beach. Back in the car, getting ready now to drive back to Philly. Weather has deteriorated, but that's not why I'm leaving. I'm leaving because it's time to go back home. Can you hear the thunder?